Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's jump right into it. In this video you will see in which direction the price of EOS has moved recently. Additionally, you will find out what the technical indicators EMA, RSI and MACD are predicting about its price and future movements. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. Looking at the hourly time frame for EOS, the price rapidly went down with around 5.7% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 2.64. We can see that the sellers are taking over because the volume was high, showing that this move was strong. Jumping to the hourly exponential moving averages, the current price is now in the hourly ribbon, so you should see if the ribbon could hold support, currently at around 2.61. The ribbon is relatively spread out so the support should be considered. Looking at the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI is at 49, so it doesn't show signs of overbought or oversold conditions at this point. Looking at the hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. We can expect for the price to continue going down or perhaps remain at least stable because the MACD histogram shows the momentum currently being strong. Moving to the three hourly exponential moving averages, at the moment, the price is above the three hourly ribbon, which can be perceived as bullish and the ribbon could play as a support. This means that you should watch if the price could bounce off the ribbon. The current price to watch is around 2.57. The support should be considered because the ribbon is more or less spread out. Jumping to the 3 hourly relative strength index, the current 3 hourly RSI is at 56, so there are currently no signs of the crypto being overbought or oversold. Jumping to the 3 hourly MACD, the MACD line is above the signal line, which shows that the current trend is on the upside. But according to the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is going down. Owing to this we can expect the price to remain stable and you should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be a downward trend. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching and know that every few hours new videos are uploaded analyzing different cryptocurrencies, so be sure to hit subscribe and not miss out. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and we'll get back to you ASAP. Also, keep in mind that you should make your own investment decisions as cryptocurrency trading is very risky and these daily videos are only an overview of trends and are a purely technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. See you next time.